Mr. Prime Minister, Ministers, Your Excellencies, distinguished guests, colleagues, and friends. It is my privilege and my great pleasure to speak with you this morning to salute the extraordinary efforts you're making to build a genuinely sustainable future for Romanian industry. Industry built on active cooperation and the sharing of best practices by forging true and enduring partnerships. At Liberty Romania, we are working hard to encourage ever closer working relationships between industry, investors and financiers, academia, and of course, government. Only this way can we hope to solve the most difficult of the equations between rising populations and increasing demand, and the need to satisfy that demand without mortgaging or even bankrupting future generations. Clearly, no one company, indeed no one government, can hope to do this alone. We have to cooperate. And that is what today is all about. If we can build trust, if we can share our knowledge, and if we can pool our talents, then we will all contribute enormously to a genuinely sustainable future. Sustainable, viable, and above all, worthwhile for us, for our clients, and for the global communities we all ultimately serve. And as ever, it starts at the source with energy. When it comes to truly decarbonizing steel, hydrogen, in our view, is the only answer. Indeed, hydrogen could well become the fuel of tomorrow, not just for steel, but for industry in general. Replacing fossil fuels that have given us so much of modern civilization, but may well have almost cost us the earth. So, for us, hydrogen is to become the fuel of the future. In Romania, first, we intend to substitute the use of coal with natural gas. A worthwhile, indeed a crucial transition fuel in our journey towards carbon neutrality. All of which gives us time needed to develop our ultimate goal, generating green hydrogen as a feeder for our furnaces. And at a stroke, massively decarbonizing our means of production, helping to turn Romanian industry into a landmark of sustainability, a beacon for generations to come. To do this with certainty, conditions need to be just right. And that means abundant sources of low cost, low carbon power, power generated close to where it will be used. Hence, our program includes a series of projects for the development of various sources of low carbon electricity, such as solar, wind, and water to power the generation of green hydrogen, supporting our full transition to green steel. By these means, Liberty Galatz will help Romania deliver a true leadership position in European, perhaps even in the global revolution of our industry. For us, indeed for us all, our joint future will see nothing short of a transformation. A transformation brought about by highly trained people with the specialized skills to drive this revolution forward. As you will hear today, through our Green Steel Academy, we are recruiting, training, and upskilling the people we'll need tomorrow. Future generations of people who will help us all bring about a truly sustainable future for our planet. But, as I said, we can't do this alone. Partnerships are essential. Collaboration is vital. Events like this point the way to those partnerships. Helping Romania to become a leader in European Green Steel. A leadership position that will bring about sustainable profits and secure long-term employment for those future generations. Supporting local economies enabling industrial communities to thrive across the land. A virtuous, not a vicious cycle. Please accept my apologies for not being with you today. But more important, accept every good wish for a truly successful meeting. Like everyone throughout my organization, I genuinely look forward to working with you, 
helping to put Romania at the heart of Europe's decarbonization strategy. Thank you.